Okay, so we're back from yesterday. I almost missed the acid rounds, which is the whole point of why. Cut and drop some things off, that's fine. There we go. I feel like we're close to the end. While not being close to the end? Was a splitting headache. I guess the game's cheesy move here is they just make you think you should do what I just did and just sprint for the thing because you see it. And of course, that's when the zombie gets you from behind. This room's cool as fuck. These are tyrants. I knew tyrant was a word. I feel like Nemesis is a different game, right? Some weirdo mutant baby thing in there. Something's breathing. was the most efficient you'll ever see me play this game. <sighs> so I'm not going to waste things just to waste them. after he takes 27 shots at one more shitty zombie. Dr. Frankel. Please let me send my heartfelt congratulations in introducing a parasitic or into tyrant's brain to get a strong control of them. What a fantastic idea. However, from medical a medical perspective, I must state my disapproval because this is not our policy and you're setting a dangerous precedent. Viruses can be kept in check. Parasites cannot. They do whatever they want to do. Perhaps in your country, consumers want to buy automo automobiles with no brakes. Here in America, I know better. Then again, I have a degree in economics. You have a brilliant marketing strategy. Look forward to your talk, Dr. Bard. So I know if I get the sample, shit's gonna go bad again. But the other room's all the way the fuck back there. Hey, it's a Mega Man poster. OG Mega Man. And a little Mega Man. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna run all the way back. So I can make use of this room. <laughs> and all the things outside. Be right back in a little. So as you see, I clear that shit out. Got to recharge all my cool uh, launcher ammo's. 
We have one healing, and I'm pretty sure when we go down to the bottom here, one's going to break out the tubes. Two, we're gonna break out the tubes. This explains why they gave me so many uh, ammos and things. Look at that well played video gaming. I think those pricks touched me. Now wait for it, because what's, what's going to happen is, as always, if I can respawn some bullshit, I'm just running around. Hey, I guess not. That's nice of him. Wait, no, I wanted to keep that. Some mag ammo, handgun ammo, exploding rounds, test tube, healing. Another test tube, those are all done. Call a jump scare, but you know you know that jump scare is coming. Unauthorized materials detected. Either I've got this wrong, or I'm missing stuff. Unauthorized materials detected. <sighs> Who would have known I had to be the, the scientist myself? That was shit luck. Your world's gonna go to shit. Thanks for pulling out the vaccine. Seems like a great way to stab yourself in the throat. Also, I remember the tube being the handy uh, removal device, but sure. Saved back in the uh, back right before this goes to shit. Man, Jill was really up to some crazy shit while we were playing the other game. Okay, so yeah, if we're...
So I'm just putting everything in for a second because I'm going to focus on what we're about to do. Have to be close to the end now. Do we drop the... This is one that's going to regret down the road moves. Or that takes two slots, doesn't it? Okay. World's dumbest plan, but here we go. Yeah, it's good enough. Hey, thanks for hanging out and watching me play Resident Evil 3. The struggle bus is real and Jill's probably in trouble. If you like what you saw, please feel free to click like or click subscribe or smash the buttons or whatever you're supposed to do these days. I don't know anymore, but I appreciate you hanging out either way. And I'll see you tomorrow for more of this nonsense. Lates.